Melbourne, Australia with no more immediate worlds to conquer, newly minted world no. 1. Tennis player Naomi Osaka is looking forward to her favorite Japanese food, katsudon, and spending some downtime with her family and friends. Right now, I don't really want to do anything, I want to sleep and just spend time with people I love, Osaka said at a news conference in a suburb of Melbourne on Jan. 27, one day after her hard-fought victory over Petra Kvitova in the Australian Open Women's Finals. The Women's Tennis Association WTA, announced its new ranking on Jan. 28 and named Osaka the Nuno. 1 in the singles category. It is a historic first for an Asian tennis player women or man to soar to the top of the list. But don't look for Osaka, 21, to change her hard-hitting style. For me, just the same as I've always been playing throughout these past few matches, said a poised Osaka when a reporter asked her about being the world no. And any changes. I know that when I play now, people are going to want to beat me a lot and they're going to play their best, and they kept doing that throughout this tournament, so yeah I don't think that will change. It definitely means a lot. Osaka said about the top ranking. I think that's one of the goals you have when you are growing up so once it settles, I'm not sure if I'll have a lot of responsibilities, but I'm very happy to be in this position. As for one of the reasons for her success, Osaka credits her powerful serve, one of the best in the women's game. I think I improved my serve a lot, she said. I don't think it was the speed but more the placement. I think the placement has gotten a lot better. My serve is always something I can rely on. I have break points, I don't really get that worried, Osaka became an instant global superstar after she beat Serena Williams in the finals at the US Open in September for her first Grand Slam title. Now that she went back-to-back -back in winning the Australian Open, fans and media have raised expectations for Osaka to next claim the French Open and Wimbledon, which would constitute a non-calendar Grand Slam. I mean I feel like everyone is sort of talking about it, Osaka said. I know I've been thinking about it to win all of them in one year. But yeah, I mean it's a process and, of course, if that happens I'd be very happy, and I'm halfway through, so hopefully it works out. The new tennis queen has remained busy since her triumph, giving interviews to TV stations until after midnight and attending a ceremonial photo shoot hosted by the Australian Open's organizer in the daytime. Wearing a vibrant colored dress, Osaka stepped on the beach outside of Melbourne with the shining trophy in her hands. After some rest, she will treat herself to katsudon, a bowl of rice topped with a deep-fried pork cutlet. Osaka said the last time she rewarded herself with a Japanese comfort food was around November after the U.S. Open. She has one more task ahead, which is to take care of her no. One cheerleader, Tetsuo, her 74-year-old grandfather, in Nemuro, Hokkaido. He said at a news conference, after Osaka's victory, I am so excited. The way she won made me really nervous, and my blood pressure has been going up, his granddaughter's response, I just tell him to relax. The WTA ranking is based on the performance of results over the past year converted into points. Osaka was ranked number 4 before the Australian Open. The victory against Kavitova, who rose to number 2 in the new ranking, shot Osaka to the top. Simona Halep of Romania, who was the previous no. 1, fell to number 3 after losing to Williams in the round of 16 at the Australian Open. The highest rank an Asian tennis player had reached before Osaka was no. 2 by Lina of China in 2014.